The head of state said this when he left to Equatorial Guinea to attend the African Union Committee of the 10th Heads of State Summit tomorrow. The focus of this high-level meeting is the reform of the United Nations Security Council. Dr. Gengob says the continent is seeking a fairer and equal representation of the United Nations Security Council. As you know, Africans have decided not to be sitting on the sidelines only when it comes to United Nations. Security Council is dominated by five permanent members who come from the long Cold War era. Now we are talking about well to be equal. And we cannot be about a billion people and not have a seat in Security Council. The United Nations Security Council is tasked with maintaining global peace, impose sanctions, approve new members of the United Nations, and authorize military actions, amongst others. However, even though about 70% of the issues are predominantly in Africa, the continent has never occupied a permanent seat ever since its inception. So we are demanding two seats at this for the African countries in Security Council. Now this is a committee of 10 on the seat 10 two from Southern Africa, that's me and Zambia, and others. So we are meeting now in this country to explore the way before the AU summit. The outcomes of this summit will be submitted to the 19th report of the Committee of the C10, as well as the 29th Ordinary Summit of the African Union Assembly of the Head of States and Government, which is slated for Addis Ababa, Ethiopia, in July this year. Currently, only Russia, United Kingdom, France, Republic of China, and the United States are permanent members of the United Nations Security Council. Kaiba Rekanji, NBC News, Hosea Kutaku International Airport.